Well, time for my favorite story of the day. The Nashville Zoo, home to many interesting species. We both know that, of course. Oh, yeah. But on this week's Zoopalooza, Davis Nolan explains why many people think they are a smaller version of, get this, a hippo. A hippopotamus. <laughs> look at this thing. If you look at a Baird's taper, you might think it's a smaller version of a hippopotamus, but their closest relatives are actually horses and rhinos. Taper are um, an incredible species that are native to Central and South America. Uh, Baird's taper are one of the larger of the three species. Uh, behind me here we have our male Baird's taper. His name is Don. Um, these guys are an herbivore that are found throughout the rainforest, like I said, mostly in Central America. Uh, they're pretty incredible creatures. And it's their nose that gets the most attention. You'll notice that one of the most defining features of a taper is actually their very long snout, it's what's known as a proboscis. Um, that is actually semi-prehensile, similar to an elephant's trunk, except quite a bit smaller. But for them, it's very important. It's actually their strongest sense organ, so they have an excellent uh, ability to smell. And because of that snout, the zookeepers have a cute nickname for them. We lovingly refer to them as snorkel horses. Being semi-aquatic, they do spend a lot of time in water as well. Uh, there are definitely times in the summer when it's really, really hot outside. We'll come out here looking for the taper, and we have no idea where they are. We come down to the pool, you'll actually see they're just down, completely submerged with that little proboscis sticking up out of the water, enjoying a nice pool day uh, on those warm days. And you might say they have a nice smile. Um, the other thing that's really cute is they've got really impressive large canine teeth. And a lot of times whenever they're moving their long, long snout around, um, it almost looks like they're smiling. You'll get to see those big teeth on display. They have two Baird's taper at the Nashville Zoo, Don and a female named Juju. But Don, he's the most sociable. Don here um, really enjoys being around people, so he's great uh, to have on an exhibit on our busy days because he likes to come up and see people. Though they're native to a more tropical climate, they'll still come out on a sunny day in the wintertime as long as the temperature is above freezing. For this week's Zoopalooza, I'm Davis Nolan, News 2. Snorkel horses. Say that three times fast. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to practice because I feel like that could be room for disaster. Uh, disaster. That's why you read it, not me. Sn snorkel <laughs> horses. Uh huh. Slow and steady wins the race. That's true. And before I lose my job, Marcus, how's it look outside? <laughs>